Est-ce que vous vous êtes jamais retrouvé au supermarché en train de faire des emplettes de fruits de mer ou de viande Et vous vous êtes posé la question, mais comment est-ce qu'on dit ces mots en anglais Ton, saucisse, côte de porc, huître, moule, palourde et que sais-je encore Eh bien, si vous êtes dans ce cas, ne vous inquiétez plus. Dans cette vidéo, moi et mon ami, nous avons fait des emplettes dans un supermarché à Miami. Nous avons acheté plein de choses dans le département de fruits de mer et de viande. Suivez-nous et ayez vos carnets de notes en main. Vous allez apprendre énormément de choses. All right, so what are we shopping for now? We're shopping for meat now. We're shopping for meat. All right. Are you are you vegan or you like meat? I love meat. You love I, meat. I'm All right. So We're so sorry. <laughs> Vegans, we're really sorry about this, okay, but we got to do it. Okay, so what are we buying? These are sausages here. Sausages, okay. A hot dog is technically a type of sausage, mm -hmm. it's less fancy. Yeah, chicken sausage, okay, all of this is sausage, yeah. Then we have pork ribs here. Okay, these are pork ribs. So these are ribs? Les côtes, from... les côtes du, du porc. Ribs. Exactly. Mm -hmm. How much are they? So this is $16.98. Oh, it's not, okay, so, so they have the per pound and then they show you what the total price is. So $16.98 is the total price. It's $9.99 per pound. And then you can see 1.7 pound. If you multiply that by 10, you get the $17. All right. It's also on sale. <laughs> All right, a lot of the stuff here. So you gotta pay attention. When they say on sale, it's not everything. They tell you exactly what's on sale. So Kiel, what is on sale today? The St. Louis style okay. pork spirits. So as you can see, it's just one item. So you gotta find it. But we're not buying the on, on sale item. But if you wanna buy the on sale item, you gotta find exactly that name here. All right. And I do love pork and there's so much of it here. <laughs> we have more Guys, do you love pork? Let us know if you like pork. All right, these no, are good. pork chops here. <laughs> Okay, some of pork, them pork are, chops. Yep. Some of them are served with the bone and others are boneless. Mm. Donc s'il n'y a pas l'os dedans, c'est boneless. Boneless, vous voyez. Donc boneless, ça veut dire que il n'y a pas l'os dedans. And some of them have bones in them. That's what Kiel is trying to tell you. And these are more special rare meats. There's lamb here, which I love. Uh huh. L'agneau. L'agneau, c'est lamb. Lamb. Little lamb chops. They're uh -huh. very, very tiny, though. <laughs> Why do they call it chops? Is it because of the way they are chopped? I think so. Uh -huh. Yeah, and they come with um, with bones, the same way you see. Okay, the so pork anytime chop. you hear chop, it has bones in it. Okay, so anytime you hear chop, lamb chop, pork chop, it has bones in it. So, as you can see, they have bones in them. And there's lamb shoulder as well. Okay, shoulders and l'épaule. Shoulder, lamb shoulders. You see that? Lamb shoulders. And we also have a little bit of bison here. I've never cooked bison. Oh, ça c'est les bison. Kiel said that she's never had bison before. Do we say bison or bison? I say bison. Bison. What does Z sound? Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. So she said bison. Bison. <laughs> bison. Biden. We don't know. <laughs> but again, I've never really cooked it. Right. Don't so say that she gets a pass here. because she's never cooked it before. So maybe, it is bison. maybe it's Biden <laughs> after all. <laughs> all right. So, but it's 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 written with um, one S. So it can be bison, it can be bison, we're not sure. Okay, you let us know. You know what it's like actually now that no. I think of it? Like goat? 
Oh no, the, the pronunciation. Oh no. Uh, bison reminds me of pizza. Pizza, yeah. See? So it's not pizza. <laughs> it's not pizza. It's pizza. So maybe it's bison. Maybe. Okay. All right. So you let us know. Yeah. Okay. Let's look over here. Wow. We have a ton of stuff here. Can we start from this side? Like. Oh wow. These are already seasoned. Okay. So you hear, you hear that seasoned? They're seasoned. So that means they add seasoning to it. Okay. So uh, lamb skewer. So anytime you see it on the little thing, it's called a skewer. Okay, Bochette's skewer. And then you've got chick chicken, chicken kebabs. Uh-huh. Beef kebab. Beef kebab. Nice. More sausage. Yeah. Bacon. Oh, ça c'est le lard, bacon. They taught me this so much. So in French is lard, lard. That's a lard. Okay. Pork chorizo. Yeah. Is that a, a category of pork or what is what does that mean, chorizo? Chorizo is. It's a special sausage. It's from, it may be Mexican in origin. Okay. Definitely Latin. Got and it. And it's spicy a little bit. Got it. Pork chorizo. Chorizo. Then there's a bunch of steak, mm -hmm. different steak types. There's filet, mignon, which I'm sure you're going to correct me on my pronunciation. <laughs> filet mignon. <laughs> okay, so we've got some filet mignon here. Um, but yeah, different kinds of um, steak cut and um, types. 100% grass fed. Grass fed, that means that they only had grass. Okay, grass fed. And that means they're the healthiest type. Okay, so all of this is meat. This, all of this is the meat section, different types of meat. And you will notice that the prices in America, they have nine, 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 nine. It's a psychological trick <laughs> because instead of saying 13, they will say 12.99. So your brain is only looking at the big <laughs> number. <laughs> <laughs> no, but the brand doesn't work like that. Mm -hmm. Do you mind getting on camera? <laughs> All right, so tell them. Everybody knows it's thirteen dollars. It's not twelve dollars. <laughs> it's not twelve dollars. It's not. You hear it? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> we appreciate it. <laughs> All right, so what is this big meat? Oh my gosh, that's a, a lamb shank. A whole leg of lamb here. Oh yeah. my goodness. That one is a horse shank. That lamb shoulder we saw before, uh -huh. that's a bigger piece. We saw the little slices of it. Got it. Which is that, sliced up. Right. So this is sliced up. This is the whole shoulder right there. You're learning those terms, sliced up. It's sliced up. And then the rack of lamb. Oh, it's a special rack. Uh, rack of lamb. This, this is a, uh, this is lamb? Right here, this is steak. Mm -hmm. This is steak. Dry aged as well. So usually that means... Oh, no, yeah. So it's a process that takes a while or dry aged. I wonder how long it takes to dry age steak. Yeah, they actually didn't say. Mm. I'm sure we could ask though. Yeah. All right, and then, oh, they have chicken here? <laughs> it's just Wait. a little bit of chicken back here. So, normally they're not supposed to have chicken here because it's all like, like, I mean, chicken is meat too, but it has its own section normally with ducks and, and turkey and stuff like that. But yeah, they have chicken here as well, as you can see. Chicken wings. Yep. All right, I think we covered the meat, or we have a little section there. Do we have a section? Yeah, for there. more parts of the chicken. Okay, let's let's look at the chicken. Okay. All right, we have whole chicken legs. Mm -hmm. This looks more restaurant quality. Yeah. <laughs> and then you have drumsticks and thighs that have been separated. Drumsticks, drumsticks, and thighs, chicken thighs 
organic. Everything is organic here. Okay. Organic chicken split breasts. Organic chicken thighs. Chicken wings. And all of them, of course, have different prices. And then whole chickens down here too. And then, yeah. So, lorsque c'est tout, tout la poule, c'est whole chicken. Whole chicken. So you see, it's a whole chicken. Whole chicken. You could also buy ground chicken. Ground chicken. Donc ça a été mâché. Vous voyez que ça a été mâché? On appelle ça ground. Ground chicken. Ground chicken. All right. So are we done with the meat, so. the meat Just, and chicken section? That's right. Do they have tur They have turkey here. They do have yeah, a turkey bit breast. Of turkey. I see. The ground turkey here. Turkey. Turkey breast. Ground dark turkey. Drumsticks. Drumsticks. That's the thigh. Is that the thigh? That's the lower part of the leg. So if you look at this, the chicken leg that we saw yeah. at the very beginning, yeah. up front. Right here. These are the drumsticks. Oh. Yeah. So it's um, it's this section <laughs> that they cut. It's called drumsticks. Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Stop. J'espère que vous apprenez énormément dans le département des fruits, de mer et de viande. Prenez des notes, c'est très important. Écoutez, je sais qu'il y en a parmi vous, vous me suivez, ça fait un bon bout de temps, mais vous vous dites, et hey coach, vraiment, pour une raison ou pour une autre, j'arrive pas à maîtriser l'anglais, j'ai besoin d'aide. Si vous êtes dans ce cas, ne vous inquiétez pas, nous avons un programme d'immersion anglaise sur mesure pour les francophones comme vous. Si vous êtes intéressé à en savoir plus, dans la barre de description de cette vidéo, il y a un lien. Cliquez sur ce lien, remplissez les informations et moi-même, je vais vous contacter pour vous en dire plus. All right, everybody, on repart. Terminez nos emplettes. KL, what are you going to show us now? Seafood. Oh, seafood. It's one of my favorite foods. Yummy. <laughs> so we have Atlantic salmon. Okay. Atlantic salmon. Did you hear how she pronounced that? Did you say salmon? Mm. Salmon. It's, <laughs> see, she's laughing at us. It's not salmon. It's salmon. Salmon. Okay, salmon. Though I will say, this is a bit of a debate. Some people in the U.S. say salmon, but I think they're wrong. Okay. <laughs> well, let us know what you hear. Put it in the comment. What do you hear? Do you hear salmon or do you hear salmon? All right. We have tilapia here. Thank you. A white fish. Tilapia. Different types of snapper, yellowtail and red snapper. Mm -hmm. Snapper. Grouper filet. So grouper is a red grouper is a type of fish. Filet mm. is how they've sliced it. To okay. Bones. So you hear that. When you fillet something, you see what it says? Filet. That means you slice it. <laughs> A particular way. And this is wild caught mm -hmm. versus over here, this first salmon we saw was farm raised. Okay, so you see the difference as well. Farm raised, farm raised versus wild caught. Which one is wild caught? Okay, so you see mm -hmm. this one, for example, it says wild caught. This one is raised in a farm. So now you know how to say that in English. These here, this is tuna steak, yellowfin tuna and this is swordfish. They're both described as steak, not mm. because they're beef, but because of how they're cut. They're cut really thick, the way Got you would it. see a steak. Very nice. And do you, like all, do you like all these fishes, or which one do you prefer? I love wild-caught salmon. Okay. Because of the color, the flavor, the nutrients. Yeah, it's, it's very healthy. Way better for you. All right, guys, you see the prices? These are in American dollars, in U.S. dollars, okay? Very nice. Do they have crabs? <laughs> yes, we have different <laughs> shellfish. Okay. Dungeness crab, it's here. 
and they're broken into clusters. They're not showing you the whole crab together. Yeah, yeah. They're not alive. Like at certain supermarkets, you will see the big old crabs like alive, but no, they're not alive here. So what fish is, oh, this is this the branzini? This is, oh, do not touch fish, okay. So it says whole branzini. I've always heard about branzini and I, I, I didn't know what they looked like. So I guess this is, either it's a yellowtail snapper or it's a branzini. I guess that's the yellowtail. I'm not sure. Guys, I'm not sure. I'm just showing you fish, okay? And the names. All right. And branzini, what's the difference between that and branzino? I honestly don't know. <laughs> <laughs> is it a mini branzino? That's a branzino? good question, yeah. That is a good question. Branzini, branzino, potato, potato. <laughs> So we're not sure about that. <laughs> and there are more shellfish here. Clams. Okay. Uh, can you just explain what a shellfish is? What does that mean? Yes. Shellfish. It means that it has a hard shell. Ça a une carapace. Vous comprenez la carapace. Donc on l'appelle shell, shellfish. La carapace est shell. So oysters, clams, and mussels are the most common ones you uh -huh. see here. And there's so much shrimp, so yep. many different sizes. Wow. Some come cooked, but most come raw. Mm -hmm. And so when they say 31 to 40 counts, what does that mean? Like that's what, so the cost of this means that they will have, what does that mean? 31 to 40 counts? Yeah. I never really understood that. 16 to 20 counts. Mm -hmm. You have any idea? Yeah, it's it's sort of the backwards in mm. your mind. When you see 16 to 20, when you see a lower number for the same pound, mm. this represents how many shrimp you'll find in a pound if you were to weigh it. Got it, got it. Here you'd find more. So if you can find more in a pound, that means the shrimp themselves are smaller. They're tinier, yeah. Got it. Okay. So, and then for shrimps, they have the, the vein, sometimes they call it the, the vein. Mm -hmm. Like this one. Like this. The vein, what does that mean? The vein shrimp. No, oh, peel. That means it doesn't, yeah. peel and the peel and the vein. That means it doesn't have the shell. You can mm -hmm. see how nice it is, like, versus this one has the shell. So this is not the vein. Oh, this one is peel, but it's not the vein. That's it's interesting. Easy peel. So easy that means peel. It's, easy. it's supposed to be easy for you to take it off. Got it. Got it. And then scallops are also some of my favorite. Seafood. Scallops. It's big and fleshy. Scallops. Vous comprenez comment on prononce scallops? C'est pas scallop. Scallops. And it's expensive. Oh my goodness. Forty-five dollars a pound. <laughs> that I only buy on sale. <laughs> no. And then how do we pronounce this? This is octopus. Octopus. It's really delicious too. Octopus. A lot cheaper too. Mm hmm Tell us in the comments if you like octopus. Um, and a lobster. Lobster. You see the difference between the, the prices of the lobster, octopus, and the sea scallops. And then squid too. What oh, makes up squid. You guys watch that um, movie Squid Games? <laughs> this is what they look like. Squids. Squids. Alright. Alright, so we're gonna sign out. <laughs> we are, yes, all done. <laughs>